former rental from Captain Video in Millway, California. So I think it's California. And Video Guardian. Mag One. Haven't checked any of these yet. Do not see any form of printing on this. Oh, but it does have the barcode sticker on there. That's a plus. Purchase from Blockbuster on February 17, 1994. 222nd day in 1988. If you know what the product it is, you can let me know in the comments. I don't see any other form of printing on this, but maybe there might be something under the side of the Blockbuster sticker. Maybe not. Anyways, just remind, please rewind. Thanks. The end. Printings. Oh, and the sticker. I didn't even see. It could possibly be from the duplicator. I don't know. Possibly. Someone named Linda B. Pesu or used to own this, but it's mine now. So I think that's how you pronounce the last name. August 6, 1990. I don't see any form of printing on this, except for that little 35 right there. No print date on this tape.
August 30th, 1994. Current looking for the demo VHS of this. I hope to find that someday. Number 13 and 42nd week of 1996. Purchase from Blockbuster on September 16th, 2001. Number... 43. Second week of 1998. Purchase from Blockbuster on July 8, 2000. Two, two days before my first birthday. Um, number 44. Third week of 1998. Number 68 and 53rd week of 1998. Purchase from Blockbuster on October 29, 2004. Let's see if there's anything under this Blockbuster label. <coughs> Sorry, it's just my nose is a little stuffed up. It's been stuffed up for the last couple days now. Yeah, a little runny, you know what I mean? That's why I did that. <coughs> Anyways, what do I see on this tape? seen anything so far. But if I do find something, I'll let you know what it is. Printings. But let me get to the. Let, let me peel a little more off. That way you can see at least most of it.
Okay, so here's what I got in terms of mo some of the blue ink printings. So the so it looks like this appears to be duplicated by WRS Motion Picture Video Laboratory. Oh, and I can see it. 006. In grade right there. I wonder if this one will have anything at the end. Once I check this tape, I'll let you know what it has. Like I said, I have not checked anything yet. So, once I check any of these tapes, I'll update you in the description in terms of what they have. Purchased from Blockbuster on August 30th, 1999. Oh, OHV. Well, I tried, well, I started on peeling the tape's Blockbuster label. Let's see what else I can get off of there. <laughs> Sorry about that, folks. That was another part of my runny nose thing. But carry on. April 6, 1999. This time it's a Hollywood video label, but it does also say OHV right there. Well, let's see what the part date is on this. If I can even get to any of it.
April 6, 1999. Full length screening cassette. VHS orders due May 9, 2000. DVD orders due April 18, 2000. Street date May 30, 2000. Cross trailer on Flawless and Molly. March 13, 2000. Red Lead. Uh, number 60. 29th week of 2000. This one I got from eBay recently. Well, I had a copy of this at one point, but it got... Both tapes got damaged while I was trying to clean them, so I ended up selling my old copy on eBay. I got this copy from eBay recently. So, hopefully this copy, none of the two tapes on this copy will be damaged at all. Because if they are, because if they are not, then I'd like to be able to upload this on the Microsoft Activate Showcase with audio from Activate's Lala and Poe. But if you have Activate's Tinky Winky or Dipsy or even both of them, and maybe even Lala and Poe as well, I'd like you to help me more upload this with the full effect, the Tinky Weeky and Dipsy. Plus any other Teletubbies content. Yeah. Any other Activates compatible Teletubbies company content you might have. So there's take one. So temperature 2000 and number 20. As for take two. October 4, 2000, number 06. June 15, 2001, number 12. Purchase from Blockbuster on February 4, 2002. Part 1 and Part 2. Alright. Let's see what we can see on Part 1 first. So tape one appears to have been ported in August 2001. Tape two, on the other hand, Also appears to have been printed in August 2001, I think. Yeah, that sounds about right. I don't know. 
First this one block was on February 2nd, 2004. Groundhog Day, 2004. And I'm not even going to try on this one because the print date's probably just going to end up being ruined. Chances are. This is volume two. June 24th and November 11th, 2003, number three. Um, uh, number 98, I think. Fifth week of 2004. And it looks like this is a recycle type. 